Hi all, this is Ashwin P. Chandra, Director of CGP Caddy Revenues and Etsimo Private Limited. Today, I'm going to talk about why you should register second paper for gate examination. Many students lose this golden opportunity by not registering for second paper. Okay, I'll tell you the importance of registering. For example, say if you are an electronics and communication student, and you have to study around eight to nine subjects for gate examination. Okay, and it happens say on 5th of February. Okay, and if you register for instrumentation also, then the advantage is you 80 to 90 per hour topics are same. So without any extra preparation, you can write instrumentation paper on another date or another time. Okay, so it gives you two opportunity to get into PSUs or IATs. So why you should miss that opportunity when you have provision for that? And you have to choose second paper wisely. For example, say you are an aerospace engineering student. Okay, you can write gating, aerospace engineering, and mechanical engineering, production industrial engineering, and also engineering science. So you can choose any of these two, any any two combinations while registering for gate. If you are a civil engineering student, you can write gate in architecture and planning. You can write in uh, environmental you can also write in engineering science or geomatic engineering but if you choose engineering science the advantage is anywhere you have to study strength of materials and fluid mechanics or civil and you can choose these two topics alone in engineering science okay same for chemical engineering students if you choose engineering science as a second paper then you don't have to put extra effort because you have to study thermodynamics and fluid mechanics for chemical engineering now, if you're a computer science engineering student, you can choose data science and AI as the second paper. There are so many topics that overlap with first paper. Okay. Now, if you are an electronics and communication engineering student or electrical engineering student or an instrumentation engineering student, you can choose one instrumentation engineering as one paper, electronics or electrical as a second paper based on your branch. Okay. So here also 80% of the syllabus overlaps so you don't have to put extra effort but if you are an electronic student and you have to write in physics a second paper you have to put a lot of extra effort to perform well in physics examination you won't get time for that so choose second paper wisely and there are some students who choose another branch paper also but the problem is many PSUs have eligibility criteria based on your beta branch so choose second paper wisely and prepare well for this exam. And our organization, CGP Career Revenues, run by Etsimo, is providing a comprehensive program for helping students to get into IITs or PSUs. We are the only center in India that provides one-to-one -one coaching for students to crack this exam. So if you are someone very seriously looking to crack this exam, you can contact in the number scrolled in this video. We'll be more than happy to help you. We create one-to-one -one study plan for each student. Also, please consider subscribing this channel. We will post information on various government exams, placement opportunities, and pattern of various companies.